hello welcome to my channel today we want to explain the concept of board mass or better still bed mass some places we also call it PEMDAS all right when they come to this each of the letters is just an acronym B stands for bracket the O here stands for off off uh, could be exponent and all those things because E here also stands for exponent so you deal with exponent is an order of uh, uh, operation so first of all we treat bracket we treat off if there is an off which we also tell as multiplication you deal with that or if there is an exponent you deal with the exponent then you deal with division division will be dealt with then multiplication followed by addition then we have for subtraction but division and multiplication are together we can do any one first just solving from left to right if there is addition and subtraction present in the question uh, are present like we have 4 minus 5 plus 2 we solve from left to right no matter how you solve it the answer will be the same whether you solve the a first before the s provided it is from the left to the right all right so in this when solving questions under fractions First thing to do is to change any mixed fraction into improper fraction. That is not present in the board mass, but it is part of fraction calculations. You must change all mixed fractions to become improper fraction. Using our denominator here to multiply this, this will give us, uh, this time this will be 60, then this is going to be 14, so 74 plus this, we have 75 over 2 divided by 5 over 9 of in the bracket 4 7 1 5 minus this will be 240 240 plus 1 241 over 3 so now this is the question that we are going to operate on board mass b first so bracket so i'll maintain my 75 over 2 divided by 5 over 9 of in this bracket i look for my lcm which is going to be 35 right so this will multiply this to give me 20 20 plus 7 i'll have 27 this time this will be 35 we've dealt with how to multiply fraction uh, how to add fractions using the butterfly method so this will multiply this so this and this plus this and this then you multiply your denominator and that is what we have here so minus 241 over 3 so what do we do we are done with what even though there is a bracket here we can eliminate it. there is no operation in the bracket so the bracket has been dealt with so b is gone now we move off to what? Off. And off is just multiplication. So I have 75 over 2 divided by 5 over 9 times 27 over 35. 2, 4, 1, 3. We are done with our off. We are now moving to division, if there is division. So this is division. This is also division. You can see there's a common factor for 9 and 27. There's a common factor for 5 and 35. So I can divide. I'm not multiplying. So this will go here 1, go here 7. Go here 1, go here what? I think that will be 3. So this can be rewritten as 75 over 2 divided by 1 times 3 over 7 minus 2, 4, 1 over 3 we are still having our multiplication so we need to deal with division first but you can see one times any number give us the same number so this could be changed to 75 over 2 this is going to be divided by 3 over 7 minus 241 over 3 we are still holding our division 
this is just giving us any number multiplied by one still produce the same answer. So no matter how we multiply, we still get the same word answer. So now let's go to our division. In our previous lesson, we learned that division can be changed to multiplication, while the second fraction will be flipped. So this becomes 75 over 2 times 7 over 3 minus 241 over 3. Just following the procedure, division. Now we get what? Our multiplication. But still there's a division here. I can see 75 divided by 3. So this will go here 1, 25. So I have 25 over 2. Then here is going to be times 7 over 1 minus 241 over 3. Now we are going to employ our multiplication. So here this will multiply 20. 7, 20, 140. 140 plus 7, 5, 35. So we can have 140 then 35. That will be 175. So 175 divided by 2, 241 over 3. For our rule of uh, subtraction, we can still use our butterfly method here, whereby this will multiply this, you get your answer. This will multiply this, get your answer. Divide by the multiplication of this. As in, you multiply, you multiply, subtract the result, then multiply your uh, denominators. So we are going to have 1, 75 by 3, 15, 1, this is going to be 21, so 22, carry 2, this is going to be 3, so 5. So we have 2, 5, 2, 5, minus, this is also going to multiply, 2, 4, 1, 2, 2, 8, 4, this time this is 8, 4, so 4, 8, 2, then this will multiply to give us what? Our 6. We have done all this in the previous lessons. Addition, subtraction, multiplication using the butterfly method. So this is going to be 5, 2, 5, minus 4, 8, 2, all over 6. We can do that subtraction overhead from here and leave our answer. So 5, 2, 5. 4, 8, 2. This will give us 3 by subtraction. This is going to be 12. We will get 4, right? This will be 1. So, sorry, it will be 4. So we are having 43. So 43 over 6. And this could be our answer, but we can still change this to become a mixed fraction. So how many 26 uh, can we get in 42? I believe we can get 7. That is 7, 6, 42. So this is going to be 7 whole number, 1 out of 4, 6 as our answer. So when it comes to board mass or bed mass, you only follow the order. Don't forget multiplication, multiplication and division are together. Both can be tackled from each other meaning you can start with division and multiplication if you are moving from left going to right addition subtraction also follow the same order so this is the procedure you follow under bed mass or board mass or better still pem das i believe you get the concept if you do don't forget to share this video like it and comment thank you for watching bye bye